Hello, good evening, happy new year, and welcome, and hello. Uh, it's me, Chris, Gross Models, uh, and this is, as ever, Warhamster Sunday. Um, it's the Warhamster show, the late show. Uh, after Fox does his at three o'clock, I come along at eight o'clock and do a little bit of my own. Um, there was a, I finished the, the weird knob, uh, which is somewhere, where is he? I'll, I'll grab him, won't be a sec, where did I put him? I had him over there, there we go. Um, last time. Uh, I finished that, so that's all done now, so I'll move him out of the way again. Um, there was a vote, a public vote, and you voted for more of this. Uh, the fighter bombers, uh, the Orc Air Wah. Um I did two of them before, I uh, did those before the weird knob. So uh, yeah, there's, there's two more in the box to do. So I shall be building those today, and then next week or two or three, we'll see about getting them all painted up. Uh, so that's what they're basically going to look like. Uh, although I'll be doing a another different variant because because I can basically. Uh, um, let's just have a quick look through the chat. Where did I put my mouse? There it is over there. Um, let me just have a, a quick scan through. Make sure everybody's saying that they can see and hear me and everything's here. Uh, everyone's saying everybody. Yes, everybody's here. Uh, right uh, as ever. Uh, first one here was Pascal. He was here a couple of hours ago. Uh, then Dad and Quantum Man came in. Uh, then Gemma came in and complained that I didn't make her a cup of tea because she didn't ask for one. But I went and made her a cup of tea. Then I came back into the chat again. Uh, Eric came in. Uh, he got cross because he thought I left because he came in. But I, I left before you came. Honest. I didn't. I didn't even see you were there. But yeah. Um, so everyone was chatting amongst themselves. Uh, Eric. Eric. Uh, then cynical Steve came in. Good evening to you. Uh, talking about stuff and things. Uh, then uh, everyone's still talking about getting old. Uh, Lewis Williamson is here. Uh, Candy Grand for Mongo came in. Uh, then everybody. Then it's uh, when, then then I went live. Uh, then Shane's come in. Uh, Edward's here as well. The Orc Boys and Underdog Painting. And that's everybody. Uh, Eric, no way, wrong colour, says my wife Gemma. I uh, don't know what that was for. Paint them blue. Oh, right, about painting things. Yeah, there'll be four different colours, just because there are. Um, excuse the, the white paint on my fingers. I've I've started doing the Bane Blade. Um, so I've been doing some priming and things in, in white and trying to test out, see if I can get digital camo to work in any way, shape or form. So I've, I've got a couple of test pieces like that that I've just done some rough uh, digital camo shapes and you can just about see the masking of it somewhere on camera I think um, so when that's dry I shall be taking those off and seeing if it's going to work well I'm going to have to make it work because you know but yes uh, that's uh, the shape of things to come I've been doing some recording of the, the next video in that series uh, earlier on so uh, yeah uh, right let's see um yeah, everyone's just talking nothing nothing particular in the chat at the moment, so I'll uh, let you carry on with that as I carry on with this. Um, we've got... Yeah, so that's how you meant to do them. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. The checkerboard is, again, something the one might branch into. We'll see how it goes. Uh, we have decals, which, again, not going to be used until it's painted. Uh, the base is probably going to end up having to use those. We've got spare thingies as well so I'll put those in there because I'll be using two now that's that right that's the sheets what we got let me put things down need some more areas to put things uh, this was the the sprue that I did for the other two as I recall they are identical yes yeah so basically you can tell the bits that I've had left over just some extra ordnance and things so I shall put those back in the box for now I'll cut them off at some point and put them back in my extra uh, stuff. Um, yeah, extra stuff box. Uh, right, so the instructions for this is fairly simple. Obviously, it gives you a choice of options as to different uh, bombs and ordnance and things. Uh, now, this obviously tells you to do different wing options. What have we got? You've got the choice of the bendy wings, the slightly wings, and the um, other 
bits of things. So what I shall do is keep these to hand and try not to duplicate them. So basically when I'm doing, you've got uh, two different cockpits assemblies for them, uh, different wings and different tails. So I'm gonna mi mix them up a bit. So I'll put this cockpit with you know those wings and, and that tail or that tail and those wings and just generally mix it all up um, to make it you know different. I don't want two the same. So let's start. I'm not going to be playing the game. So the bases aren't used for me in that respect, but they are the thing that stop them falling over. Uh, this is all to do with movement and attacks and things. So you can you have to set your moves sort of before you have your go, and then they're there for everybody to see that you're not cheating and saying, oh, because you moved there, I'm going to actually go this way. Uh, Simon got the stickers, big thank you, no problem at all, happy to set about and help out. Um, if you want to put any pictures of stickers received or things up in the, the gross group, um, then feel free, the group is there, just put the link back in the chat again, which will appear momentarily. Um, it's there, the group, the group is there for everybody to put stuff in as and when they want to really, there's no... Uh, sort of rules about stuff but basically any pictures you put in there I might well show off on a Thursday night on my uh, evening with stream so uh, yeah join join up and get in there and chuck stuff in um, and that's that uh, let's have a look I'm gonna get straight in because you know you've got to start somewhere um, I've, I've rearranged my bench a little bit you can see there's no empty paint pots laying around because I've actually got uh, I've got a light in the way. I've got more paint spaces. Look, there's, there's extra paint spaces over there, and and, and the extra ones over there as well, and and a cup. I I got some uh, Warhammer vouchers, so I, I went in and got an extra couple of paint trays to put things in, and and I saw they've still had the uh, the original paint mugs, which I'm not going to use for paint or you know water. It's or, or drinking out of. In fact, I figured I'd just use it to put things in. So I can keep some stuff in there. So as and when I get bits cut off the sprue or whatever, or extra ordnance and things, I can just dump them in there and we'll see. Uh, that's a strange looking battle wagon, says Osric. It's quite strange because um, it's not a battle wagon. Uh, the battle wagon didn't win. It got some votes. Everything got some votes. So I'm quite happy that everything got a vote eventually. But uh, no, it didn't win, so I'm not building it. Well, I'm not building it yet. I shall be building it at some point. Um, just getting these bits off while I'm talking. One, two, three. Oh, the, the, the front bit's different as well. I remember now. There's options for fronts, I think. Yes. Uh, so we've got one, two, and three. That was two that I just cut off. So let's cut off one. And three. Because they're for one front, and then for the other front, you've got the other the other bits. So let's keep them separate as well. Uh, where I'm building two, I'm going to build them sort of at the same time. Just to keep things rolling, keep things moving along. Uh, so I need five for that one. That's that one there. Uh, yeah, the battle wagon is still online. Um, Fix says Vox. It wasn't. It was not, not. I don't know how I could fix it. it. Everyone got votes, and people voted for things, and the one with the most votes won. Um, it, it's all there. It's all above board and everything. I'm perfectly happy to build any of them. I'm sure I'll get round to all of them at some point anyway. So uh, yeah, it's not exactly that uh, anything's winning or losing out from being voted for or not being voted for. So you know. Uh, apparently Chris doesn't wear gloves while painting, says Eric. I, I sometimes do, but today I didn't. Um, I, I have no excuses. Uh, I just sort of wanted to get it done, so I just didn't. Um, I yeah. It's it's white primer, and um, 
it didn't go down very well. It was very messy. Luckily, it was only on um, sort of test pieces and stuff, so I'm not overly concerned. But uh, there we go. I shall also be using my extra thin, but not in a thing because yeah, but it's fine. Don't worry about it. I need to see which bits goes where. So this is that way up with that at the top and the back like that. And that goes, that's, oh, these are the bits that go together. I remember how these go together now. These two outside bits sort of go together. Like that. And they sort of go around the other bit. So we can get that there. Give that just a couple of seconds to set in there a little bit. And then that goes around that bit. Uh, something like no not like that I can't sell that goes up there that goes in that way round <sighs> messed it up already can't... oh there it is it's lower lower than I thought it was that's why it goes in there like that right then we can get some glue around the edge there That's that bit. It's having a forgetful day. No, I'm not. I'm not. What? No dad's device. I, I've got a dad's device, but it only holds three paints, uh, three glues, not a single one. And it gets in the way if I try and use all of them over here. I shall just be very careful and not knock it. it it's a big square thing. I, how can I possibly knock it over? It will be fine. Trust me, I'm a professional. Uh, everyone in Florida is recounting the votes, says Edward. Uh, who's not going to vote for a dirty great big orc truck? Well, lots of people, apparently. It, it got some votes, but not all of them. These got most votes, so that's the way it works. I posted the results. You're fine. You can check up on the results if you like. You can check them online. I don't know. All the troubles in the world and people are thinking I'm faking my things. Uh, Paul Masso's in, saying good evening all. Uh, I might have missed some because the chat's going past while I'm doing this. Um... No one has ever removed all the lines off their cutting board with spilled tip. No, I, I haven't. I'm sure some people might have, but I, I didn't. I've never done it, so, you know. I don't know if I've ever seen it done. I've seen some things done, but not necessarily everything. Uh, right, I need nine and seven. Uh, so that's ten, so that must be nine. So this is the, I say the cockpit, but it's actually the whole body of the ship that's different one way or the other, isn't it? So let's get that one off. And it goes with number seven for the other side, for the underneath bit. So let's get rid of that. Get it all off, there it goes. Seven is not eight, it's that one. Although they look the same, I'm pretty. Oh no, it's like differences in the front there. So they they probably are different. So how was everybody's New Year and Christmas time? Because uh, obviously I've been around since before Christmas time, but uh, first time I've seen any of you on my channel since since the New Year. So uh, how are you all? Are you all doing well? Did you have a good time? Good Christmas time and stuff. Uh, talking about me getting old, yeah, okay. Uh, right, so let's have a look. Uh, I treasure my dad's device. I would never think to not use it. Uh, yeah, it's 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 a three. I'll, I'll show. I'll grab it. Show you later. It holds my extra thin, my extra thick, and my sprugu. So, uh, yeah, I don't want to be moving all of them around when I don't have to, do I? 
It was made with love and is used with love, this box, this candy gram. Yes, indeed. Uh, ba, ba, ba. Cynical Steve says, before I got my dad's device glue holder, I just spilled glue on my lap. What, like, all the time? Or, what? Why? Uh, right, so that goes with one of the fronts. So this type, I've got that one. Which is that one. So let's go with this one for that one. And put that one in there instead. So we've got the different cockpit, different mouthpiece. And we'll go from there. So let's just get some more glue. What goes in there? That goes in there, so that goes around the outside of this bit. Let's get some slapped on. Oh, sorry. Slap it on. I'm not allowed to use my own words to say it when I've got a TED button. It's, uh, I'm not allowed to say it. Ted gets cross if I don't use his button. Uh, Christmas and New Year's seems to go by like most other days, says Paul de Uh They don't seem to be as fantastic as it used to be. Yeah, I, 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 surely you should listen to those who are watching you, says Gemma. What, have I missed stuff? I don't know. I, I ask stuff and then get distracted by other things, so don't come back to it. Um... All the time, Chris, that strip in front of my laptop that's usually full of bits is very narrow. <laughs> yeah, I know when you put pictures up of uh, your builds, they're always on top of a laptop. I'm assuming you don't actually do your builds on top of that laptop, but... Uh, Fox says, before I got my dad's device, my houseplants always died, I had no fashion sense, and I was hopeless with women. Now, I never spill things. My hair is luxurious, and, uh... Don't have to take the little blue pills anymore. Yes, um, Christmas is, is obviously all over and behind us now, New Year and stuff. I'm back at work, and... Everything's back to normal, or what passes for normal around here. You know what it's like. So, uh, yeah, I hope everybody has you know, recovered and not been drinking too much and stuff, but... Put that in there. Clip. And then we can get this blooped in the front there as well. Uh, I finally got around to finishing watching the uh, NCIS series. I, I've finished all of the ones of those that are available on Amazon Prime now. Uh, so I've started on something else. I, I started on the uh, Lost in Space. Uh, the second season of that's available now. So I've uh, drifted over and started watching those. Oh, completely forgotten what happened in the first one. I know they got lost in space. And they were saying about a robot that was a friend, but then it all blurred together. I don't I just don't remember anything else. So I started the second season, and they're still lost. So I don't think I missed anything. Uh, right now we have the engine bit at the back, which again has options. Uh, so we need parts 11 and 12 for this first one. There is lots of little detail bits in this that are going to be great fun to paint. Uh, I'm going to need 13 for the other one. So let's get that off while I'm here. Uh, so Chris, the story of your life. No spoilers. What? Just that? Oh, right. Yeah, no spoilers for Lost in Space. Although the first one was like a couple of years ago. So if you haven't seen it by now, it's probably too late. I mean, it's still there. You can still go and watch it, but... You know, um, I'm looking for 12. Oh, it's the little bit that it's one of those 14. 14's got to be the one, the other one. So let's get that off and put that with the other one. Blip. 
and back to this one for this one. Right, let's put that to one side. A little bit of tidy up. Uh, Swinging pigs here. Good evening. Uh, Zadster's also here as well. I've just seen that name pop, pop by. Uh, Fox says you're going to need to check. Practice your checker pattern for these. It's the law on orky things. Yeah, okay, because, you know, if, if I can do digital camo, I can do checkerboards and throw things on the floor. So, uh, yeah, let me... Uh, See just how subtle I can be about picking stuff up off the floor without you noticing that I've even got away. You watch, wait for it. I, I'm just gonna go and have a quick drink, so I'll be back in a minute. There he's, he's down there. I got it. Right. Uh, they come with decals, says Eric. Shush, I was hoping he would forget that, says Fox. Thanks very much. There was decals. They... Oh, yeah, look, checker patterns. Look, look, they come with checker patterns. It's fine. I'm sure that's fine. I've just got to paint the black or the white, depending on which colour I use or stuff. Uh, Orc Boy says, where is Skullfish? Or, sorry, Orc Boy says, where is... God, that was a long one. All uh, right, let's get this put on the front of this. It does go on the front, yes. That's one. Let's do the other one. Record time build this. This is going to be done in no time at all. Uh, Andrew Graham says that was unsettling. I can't hear it. I've, I've not got it set up to play through. Otherwise it comes through the mic as well. And it's Fox's fault. Um, yeah. Uh, that wasn't at all disturbing, says Esther. No, it's, it's fine. It's, you know... Uh, I don't know which one's on which, so I'm just going to pick that one and go with that. There we go. So that that one's going to go on there, that one's going to go on that one. Even if they are the same, then they'll be different down the line, won't they? So things, you know. There we go. That's one done. And that's the other one. Nearly there. Uh, ba, 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 Michael Mitchell, I've been working on a Genesis Climber uh, Mospeeder kit lately. I don't know Mospeeders. But uh, Fox says, to Muse, do you need me to break into some hardcore kick, kicking beatbox? I, yeah, I don't do beatbox. Um, but Muse is here as well. Welcome. A computer with wheels. I don't know what... Com what? I must have missed stuff, which isn't a shock. You, you're well aware by now that the chat moves and I don't see what's going on. So, uh, yeah. Number, part number 25 and 26 to do on this, which are the little bits. There's 26. I think they're probably the same. Well, they, they might be the same. There's not much between these two if they aren't the same. Uh, do beatbox says Fox. No, I think Chris is going for an early finish here. <laughs> Not particularly, but you know, it is the first one of the year, so you've got to ease in gently, haven't you? It's, um, I've been going 25 minutes already and I'm not finished. Uh, everyone here told me they want beatbox. No, I would like to see Chris to try kickbox. You don't want me to get beaten up. Uh, that goes pointing the wheel thing inwards and the other bit backwards. So it goes a bit like that. Like that in there. Okay. Yeah, no, no boxing going on. The only boxing around here was Boxing Day, but that was a long time ago. Uh, Muse says, new car, Chris. What? Oh, that was what you were talking about before, was it? Okay. 
Uh, Lewis got my first lot of Space Marines the other day with a Dreadnought thingy as well. Nice. Gonna have to hold that for a minute. Uh, and there your troubles began. Welcome to the addiction, says Fox. Go there. Let's get the other one on this. Do, 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 do. No way back now, Lewis is dead. Uh, bah, bah, bah. Then Dave shows up. What? What? Hey. Quite like the look of them, but mainly build World War Two battleships. And a dreadnought looks completely different. I would expect so. Yeah, I I know nothing about most things. So yeah, there you go. Uh, right, let's get some wings together. Uh, we've got 15, 18, and 17 need to go together. So that's 15. Do, 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 do. Yeah, 18 and 17. Here's 17. 18 is going to be over the other side. Yes, indeed it is. Alright, let's get those three glued together. Uh, we have it that way up, with that going downwards, so that's over that side. Uh, Dave's already moaning at me about the no dad's device. We talked about this earlier, Dave. If you were in on time, then you would have known the story already. Not my fault you come in late and miss all the backstory. You should have been here earlier. Uh, right, let's get the other one done, which is 16, 20, 19 and 20. Basically the other little wing. And the other, even littler wings. Can't go far wrong with these. <laughs> Eric says, Dave, we just spent 30 minutes you linking him about it. I know, I know, I know, I know. But you got to have something to shout at me about, otherwise you'd not shout at me. And where would you be then? You know Shout at Me's what gives you fun of a Sunday evening, because you, you don't dent shout at Fox during his stream. Unless it's while he's doing stabity things to make him try and stab himself, because that's just fun. Alright, let's get these on. Uh, I don't know if... Does it matter which way up? Or is this just going to make it even worse? Can I make that even more different than that one? This was these ones going down, so if I put them on the other opposite sides... That'll have them going up. So it might... It might work. Probably work. What's the worst that can happen? There we go. So we've got another unique option. Instead of having the bits going down, one of the bits going up. It's, you know, fine. That's because I use my dad's device like a good lad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't. You, we know you don't. Wings, 21-22. Are a matched pair. So let's see. 
Obviously, you've got to have the wings the same each side. But you don't have to have them with the same everything else, do you? You can mix and match everything. Uh, so, Let, let's uh, let's make you lot do some work then. Which, which uh, wings should I have on which plane? Let's uh, let's make it easy. We've got th these wings uh, with which which tail fin first of all with with those wings. Uh, one or two. So one or two. Big one or the little one, and then we'll decide which uh, which body to put them on as well. So one or two, the big one or the little one. I'll give you a minute to make up your minds while I have another drink and sit quietly and wait for you to decide for me. Uh, the Orc boys is totally right, according to my wife. I missed what I, uh, uh, I, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, two says Fox, and Lewis says one. Swigging Pig says two. All Boys says three, obviously. Two and one, so it's two, one, two, two, one. Two is winning. Two is definitely winning now, Steve. Pano Man says one. That says one and two, one and two. Testing, one, two, one, two. Uh, TK's here saying evening all. I'm probably wondering why everybody's just shouting numbers at me. Uh, 107, 69. Uh, I think uh, two has the most votes so far, so I'm sure we'll go with two. So we move that one out of the way. So which um, which body we've got the little spiky cockpit or the big sort of World War Two one? Uh, so again, one or two, one. Or two. Make your suggestions now. If you suggest after the polls have closed, you may still be charged, but your vote will not be counted. CK said numbers. Testing, testing. This is dead. Uh, Bandai kit in paint stripper. Get them out now. The plastic will be eaten alive. Yeah, Bandai plastic doesn't like most things, so yeah, be careful with that. Uh, we have two, one, two, two, one point five. Uh, two, two, three twos and one one. It looks like we're going with two, two, two. If we were playing Guess Chris's IQ, thanks very much, Dave. Two, two, look, two's got the votes, so two, two it is. So one will go on the other one. That will go with that. So we've got these to put together. Uh, we're just slipping the wings into the sides. Nice and easy. Bip. These really are um, almost Bandai level of fitability. They just go together. There's no problems, no effort, no anything. It just happens. So, uh, yeah. That's that. Uh, let me get the other wings off. Because I'll need them for the other one. I'm not going to bother voting about that because it's the only ones I've got left. So, uh, yeah. We'll, we'll go with these. They're the, basically the short, stubby versions. That'll go on those. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, Get them on the right way round. That's the only tricky thing to do. Bip. And that one on that side. Ah, that's the wrong side, see? I've been doing it wrong. That's that's that. That's that. That's got to go that side. Because they've got undercarriagey bits where the bombs fit. Got the other ones right. There we go, there's that bit on there. Cool. I shall run a bit more glue around the edge there just to make sure where I hide that one. 
in and apart again. Actually, I'll do the same on this one anyway because I can. There we go. Right, let's have a look. Uh, bah, bah, bah. What we saying? So at least I said 107, Chris. Everyone else is being nasty. Uh, Chris and Glue Spillage. I haven't done any to put any glue. I have not done it. It doesn't matter. There's pretty much nothing you can do with Bandai plastic without destroying it. Rescue it. Yeah, get it out as soon as you can. It's yeah, it might already be dead. Uh, Dave has a good big question for me. Are you going to play Aerobolica? I don't know what that is. Is that the thing? Aer Aeronautica Imperialis, the, the game? No. Uh, yeah. Paying attention there, I see, says Dad. What, me? Yeah, no. Why would I start doing that now? <laughs> uh, right, we have uh, turrets to go on. Uh, we've got two turrets which to me look the same have they got different windows they've got different windows on right so you've got to have the older style windows with the older style um, cockpit thing no choice in that that's what I'm doing whether you like it or not That's going in there. Daka Daka. And the other one. Funnily enough, goes on the other one. So, apart from that, I think it's basically built. I've just got to put the, the bombs and stuff on the bottom of it. It's very easy. Very easy, quick builds these. So far, so good. Let's get the bases done. Put them on there so we can see them in all their glory. There you go. That, that one and that one on there. So, let's see. What have we got? We've got... Uh, yeah, the different, the wings and the canopies are different. That's on there. Good, yay. Um, Dad says, Chris, can you please knock your tet over? I feel I need to say I told you so. No, it's got a lid on it now. Look, okay, there you go. Knocked it over, but unfortunately it was done up at the time. Um, I don't want it to happen, says Fox, but there would be seriously no coming back if you spilt the tet. No, it's fine. It's all it's all good. Uh no. It's not an expensive cane, right? It's it's a big cane map, but it's it wasn't expensive. Um Right, so that's those built except for the planey things. Uh I was gonna look at the Alright, oh, they've got the same teeth and the same wings, but the different cockpit and uh, uh, different engines. So yeah, they're, they're different enough, and these are obviously unique wings, re rear wing assembly things on them. Cool. So let's get some bombs on. Got to get the bombs on. Um, it gives you lists of what ones you can use and stuff, but yeah, we won't worry about that. What does it say? You've got the big ones in the middle going out to the little ones. But they all fit the same. So technically you can have anything you like wherever you like. Can't remember what I did on that one. I had some guns on the outside and different bombs on the middles and insides and stuff and things. So yeah, um, I'm going to cut some bombs off. And then we'll see about putting some bombs on. And and that'll be that. Two. Three. Four. 
five and a uh, little skinny one six and another one of them because I like the look of that it looks quite nice uh, machine gun type things perhaps not that one because that's just bent <laughs> Let's use that one instead. What have we got now? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, two. Uh, here we go. Three. That one. Four. One of them. Five and and that one. All right, so that's probably all the bits, and we'll see if they all go together. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, uh, lovely cat and match those. Too bad I hide mine under the old green one, says TK. Uh, can't smell worse than the Dorian wafers, yeah. <laughs> uh, Dave says, I've got the same mat. It's two months old and it already looks like an incontinent rhino has been sleeping on it. I don't know how it keeps you so clean. I don't do very much work. Um, I've got another one over there that's a little bit cleaner, actually, than this one. So, yeah. As Fox says, he doesn't paint like an incontinent rhino. No. The paint's meant to go on the model, not not on your back. You aren't using it like Paul uses his, are you? I noticed Paul isn't even here. So he was watching Fox's stream, but no, don't come watch mine. That's fine, I understand. I, re I remember that, Paul. It's fine. Well, you're not here. You don't know. You can't tell that I'm talking to you. So, yeah. Uh, a little bit of tidy up on these. Not much, because there's not much to tidy up, apart from that one. Do, 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 do. Uh, uh, how did you only just find out I'm in the chat? Chris even said hi live on the telly. Yeah, I, well, it's it's Fox and he doesn't pay attention to things. He probably did know and then he forgot. Uh, Fox says I didn't see your earlier comments, and then you've been and you have been lurking, and I ignore Chris anyway. It's my show. You've got to listen to me on my show. That's the rules. It's not the rules. There aren't any rules. If there were rules, nobody would be listening to them anyway. So that's fine. As you were. Um. So this is. I say the the build is now basically completed. Uh, I will before next week get them primed, get some primer down on them, and then we'll see about doing some painting. Uh, obviously, I have to do one in red because otherwise my wife will be very very cross. So one of them shall be in red. Uh, other ones shall be in other colours. Obviously, one has to be in orange because. It's the Warhamster stream. So there's there's no option there either. Uh, which does leave two others up for grabs. Um, what should we do? If, if you would like to choose a colour scheme for one of my uh, fighter bombers, um, let me know. Yeah, send it in. Um, comment on the video. No, you can't comment on this video because this video goes back to my... Patrons, actually, I'll, I'll leave this video open and available to all because it's the start of a new build. So traditionally, I do leave the start of a new build open to everybody forever. So yes, um, when this video is an actual video, uh, leave a comment underneath it uh, with a suggestion for a colour. Um, and next next time, I shall randomly pick two. Not orange, says Fox. Yeah, okay, one of them is going to be not orange. In fact, 
three of them will be not orange. Uh, three of them will be not red. But the other colours are open to all. I'm going to open my paint, uh, open my glue again now. So keep an eye on it. Um, if you would like to choose a colour, as I say, just leave your colour choice. Uh, when this video becomes a video rather than a live stream, uh, drop it in the comments underneath. And next Sunday, I shall return with um, a random comment picker. And, well, you know what it's going to do, because it's a random comment picker. It's sort of self-explanatory what it does. It, it randomly picks comments. So I shall use that to randomly pick a comment and then randomly pick another comment so you can have your own colour scheme represented don't put it in here now not not in the chat here because I won't be able to see that well I'm not going to look back for it next week so I by all means discuss things and chuck it in the chat here but that's not where it's going to be chosen from it'll be chosen from the actual comments on the bottom of the video just like uh, uh, Immortals competition. So wait until this has become a, a, a normal viewable video, which is normally about five or 10 minutes after the, the stream has ended. Um, just pop back, or oh, you're welcome to wait obviously afterwards, or pop back afterwards and um, just drop it in there. And next week live I shall choose a winner, or two winners rather. Um, ah, there you go. If if you are a winning colour, uh, then I'll also send you out a Warhamster sticker. How's that? Competition time and sticker giveaway in one. So uh, yeah, put, put your uh, choice of colour. Um in there and assuming you win obviously watch again next week and I'll get you to send, tell me where you want a sticker sent Fox is always telling me I don't do enough sticker giveaways although he doesn't do them himself anymore so so yes next week it's all there uh, it, chances are it will be a colour that I haven't got because I know what you like like But I know I've got red and orange, so I can be doing those next week. And then I can uh, make a trip to the Warhammer shop and pick up any other colour that wins. There we go. Cover them in shark mouth, says Fox. Well, you know what to do. Once it's a video, <laughs> I don't think shark mouth is technically a colour, but uh, you, you might win. That's the thing about random selections, is, is they're random. Uh, if you want to be precise and put down an actual uh, Citadel colour name, and feel free to do that. Uh, if you want to just say, you know, green, then feel free to do that. I'm not fussy. Whichever you like. However you want, whatever you like. There we go. Finish with the glue. No spilling. Look, see, look, see. No spillage. Um, we've got the bombs on, just in a random order. So there we go. Uh, Fox says KFC Gravy Brown. I don't know if that's a real colour. It's probably not a, an official Games Workshop colour. Uh, uh, I have a feeling he will not be able to buy the colours that are chosen, says Gemma. Yeah. Chrome, says Paul. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Um... 
yeah, obviously I reserve the right to use slightly alternate colours. So if you did say chrome, then I could just use a silver. Because I've got silver. But yeah, I don't mind, um, let's say, making a visit during the week, or next week, or week after, whenever, to uh, pick up the winning colour colours. So if you want to put the official Games Workshop name down, feel free. But there you go. Uh, Fox has said a base of throaty wig with a shade of folded graph paper and highlights of lurching vegetarian. I expect these are probably names that Fox has given to colours, so they probably are real colours already. <laughs> if they're not, then they will be by the time he realises that he can do that. Um, so, there we have a squadron of four uh, fighter bombers, uh, all individually unique. Um, I think Model Making Guru wants you to use KFC gravy to paint the model Um uh, Michael Mitchell, um, it's a good point. Um, yeah, Dad's got all the all the uh, KFC gravy already, so you can't use it for anything other than nothing. Gold says Steve, angry lurching vegetarian. Uh, they're from the new Citadel Bill Bailey range of paints, says Fox. Yeah, that wouldn't surprise me in the slightest either. Right. Um, yeah. So I shall get them primed. Um, I'll be doing more priming during the week anyway, so I'll be priming them in white. So that will give us a good base for any colour you want to do. If you want a light, you know, pinky, well, the orange obviously comes better over white anyway. But if you want to do a, a light pinky white colour, whatever, then that'll also go over white. Uh, metallic's probably not so good, but... Yeah. Um, other than that, that's pretty much it for the week. Um, I, I will be removing the masking from my uh, experiment, uh, but not now, not live, because it's going to go into the video. Um, the video for the, the painting part of the Bane Blade. Uh, I do have the other one that has also got digital camo masking on it and blown out the white balance of the camera. Um, which I shall be spraying in orange before I remove the masking from that. So keep tuned. Um, keep an eye on the channel for that to be coming along soon. Uh, the main blade itself, I've started priming in white. Uh, little guns and things, all, all the little bits. So uh, yeah, keep an eye on the video for that. Uh, it will be a few weeks, no doubt, because... A digital camo takes a long time. Even even just doing it, roughing, messing around by hand, it takes a long time. If I'm going to be doing it more precisely, obviously, as I am for the real thing, it's going to take longer. So that's going to be a, a long, ongoing project. But, uh, yeah, I'll give you a sneak preview of the, the colours that I shall be using. Obviously, the, the main, the main colour is orange, uh, for which I'm probably going Troll Slayer. Because it's a nice darker orange than the, the brighter... Uh, what was the bright one that we got? Fire Dragon Bright. It's a bit yellowy, a bit bright. So I'm going Troll Slayer for the, the primary colour. And then we have the red and the pink as the, the secondary and tertiary colours for the Bane Blade. Um, all of which were laid down onto the, the two test pieces earlier on. And we'll see what happens. So, yeah, we'll, we'll find out. Um, I'll be posting up no doubt throughout social media and stuff about it anyway but uh, keep an eye on the channel for the next video in that series the previous one the build build series of it is available now I think I put it live yesterday so that that's available now for if you want to get caught up I think there's four parts in it so far so the fifth one will be the final video painting episode um, and that's that's that um, there's really nothing else I can do with those now because they're built. So I need to do the the painting, the the uh, priming of those first. Uh, let's have a, a look through the chat and see if there's anything anything happening, anything exciting. Um, I, I haven't seen Skullfish she hasn't turned up, so I've got had no opportunity to press the Skullfish. 
button. Um, it, it's unfortunate, but you know, if he's not here, then I can't really press the scurly fish button because it doesn't make sense if he's not here in the chat. But uh, talking about uh, gunplay candy, gunplay candy metallic, maybe says Steve. Uh, yeah, I don't know about that. Um, Candy Graham, I miss the 80s and its utterly unnatu unnatural colour scheme. Yeah, there were some very strange colours in the 80s. Uh, Tetris Colours Digital Camo. Uh, yeah, I, the um, when I was cutting out the Digital Camo masking, I just kept doing Tetris in my head and cutting out shapes and, you know, yeah. But no. Um, bah, bah, bah. Right. Um, that that seems to be that. So uh, it just remains for me to say thank you for watching. Uh, stick around for, let's say, next week's painting. Um, don't forget to put a comment on this video with your selection of colour. Uh, try and be fairly unique in your selection of colour, although it's going to pick a name. Obviously, that will be the comment. If you did pick the same colour, then unfortunately, sorry, but it's a random comment picker. So if you know four of you pick blue and it pulls out a blue, it's only going to be the person who it actually picks out that that wins and gets their their color choice. Although you'll get your color choice, but you know. Um, Cynical Steve says a short stream but a good stream. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, ne I'll be back to normal next time. But obviously with the painting, there's more I can just continue on until time fills up. But with this tonight, it's built, so I could just sit here and chat to you for another half hour. But I'm not going to. Um, I'm going to see if I can get some of that Bane Blade done. Uh, Fox says, thank you, Gross Models, and thanks, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Like and subscribe, and always look both ways before crossing. Indeed. Um, yes, Happy New Year to all. Uh, we're all back in the swing of things now, so everything's back to normal. Uh, today, obviously, Sunday, Warhamps the time. Tomorrow is back to E-Models. Uh, we're, we're here, the four of us. Um, we've got stuff. We gave away stuff during the Christmas build, didn't we? So we've got things to winners to pick if you haven't already pop along to e-models and comment on the video that's there for the the uh the four hour long christmas build uh and you can win things uh, i don't remember what it was there was a couple of things there was a an, an at, at and and something non sci fi but uh go along comment on that uh and come along tomorrow night to e-models to see if you won uh thursday is uh, an evening with a gang. So me and hopefully a couple of members of the, the Gross Gang will be along to, to entertain you throughout the evening. Um, again, from 8 till 9.30 is the normal stream time for that. Uh, any of my patrons are uh, welcome to come along and join in as well. You never know. And uh, then we're back to Sunday again with this, with, with them painted. I'll do them shortly so I don't forget. But uh, have a happy new year and I shall see you all soon. Um, I appreciate you coming and watching. So... Thank you all, and good night. Bye.